Welcome to CC Chess Academy channel. In this video, we will show you one tip on how to beat a chess master. In this particular game, we will try to see how to beat a, a, an American national master as we all agree and as we all know chess masters in the beginning were just like you and i they were just common players but due to their persistence and hard work they were able to reach the point where they are in now be that as it may it is still possible to beat them so one tip that we could give is that don't ever think that a chess master could see everything whenever there is a situation when you need to sacrifice your peace then don't hesitate to do so in order to render a checkmate to your opponent or to have a decisive advantage which will eventually lead to your opponent opponent's checkmate so in this game one tip is to sacrifice a rook whenever it is needed as shown in the game so let us play it the national master played e4 i played g6 leading to modern defense d4 g7 c4 that is leading to many indian defense d6 knight c3 and then i played knight c6 that is the upper back system of the modern defense knight f6 bishop g4 okay he pushed i took and then occupied the central d4 square with the knight Okay, so my pawn is already on the seventh trunk. Check. That's it. Check. Night. A queen takes g3 and then he resigned because after king g1 it will be followed by queen h3 and then after he moves king g1 it will be followed by bishop bishop d4 check once the rook covered and then we have the G uh, bishop b1 check that will lead to to her to his eventual losing of the queen therefore it will be a decisive advantage for me and then to be followed by taking his rook in f4 with my bishop so in the end 
it will be a queen versus rook and bishop uh, rook versus a uh, queen versus rook and bishop so that's all see you in the next video thank you